Wonderful. We must have more. 500 cigarettes. Hello everyone, I'm creating the editing video of the Orville. This is the project file I made with After Effects. Next, it'll explain to you in detail the complete production process of subtitle lighting and fade in and fade out effects in the software. Follow along and you can quickly master it. First, you need to open the software, find the script function module, click on it, and then select the run script function in the function options, then the captioner will pop up. Here, it is particularly important to note that in the width, we need to keep the same size as the height. Because if the size is too large, the subtitle effect will overflow outside the screen when it is relatively long. After entering the same size, we can select the position we need in styling. Of course, I will choose the middle position because the visual center of a person is here. Then your cert subtitle file will pop up, select import and it's done. This is the entire process of importing subtitles. After importing the subtitle text, we can add our favorite colors to the subtitles. Once all the subtitle colors are set, we can proceed to the next step first. We need to select all the subtitles, click on the animation, and choose the preset effect of 100,000 bevel glow. Then the effect of your text will appear. Then we select all the text, choose the animation, find normal text animation, and add the fade in and fade out effects. Then we can find the U of the mouse to display all the keyframes. Then we add the subtitle files one by one and the effect can be presented, the above is the complete operation process of subtitle lighting and fade in and fade out effects, it only takes about 40 minutes to complete the tracking and processing of a set of materials, have you all learned it?